Jake Ludington here at HP Discover, and I'm here with Glenn Ferguson, and we're going to talk about why open matters. And open has, has been a big investment uh, on HP's part, and, and so why, why is that? Well, open's important for several reasons. I think as a community, it gives transparency to where the product's going. Uh, customers, participants, end users of the product can actually look at the blueprints but they can also influence by participating in the community, the projects and in the direction where things go. Um, so that's an important aspect. I think the other important aspect is no lock-in. Uh, adopting open source and in open technologies, multiple vendors that are backing OpenStack specifically, gives customers multiple providers and choices uh, when automating their operations. Are there places where open doesn't make sense or is really open the, the way to go across the board? Well, there's really been a shift in the industry over the last 10 years. Uh, open has really proven itself out. Um, I think open makes sense when you have a wide a range of technologies and people with different interests coming together. So OpenStack specifically, there's nine different projects that subject matter experts are working on independently, but they all um, work together in a seamless way. So from that regard, open matters because it's such a broad technical skill set of people coming together to solve multiple problems in the data center. Uh, so I think specifically in cloud computing, it, it makes quite a bit of sense. And, and maybe just to back a, a step up, what what do we mean when we say open? Because that, that's, a, that's a, it's, yeah. it's a pretty open-ended uh, sort of statement. Good, good question. Uh, I think open is, at least to me, means a, a community. Um, it's all about transparency. The ability to go in, in this case OpenStack.org, and look at what's going on. So open from that perspective is transparency, but it's also open from a software contribution perspective. Uh, different people with varying interests can come in and contribute to this community. So it's open in two regards, the transparency as well as the ability for others to come in and actually contribute to the project. And if you were to speculate, I'm not going to name any names, but uh, about why some of the uh, other members of the industry seem to be backing away a bit from OpenStack right now. Could you could you elaborate on why you think that might be? Yeah, I, I perhaps I haven't heard members backing away. You, you know, at the end of the day, companies are in business to make a profit. Um, there are certain companies that are making quite wealthy profits right now, um, and they're threatened by open source. So those types of companies are probably the ones that are backing away. Uh, other companies that are getting into this game, open source is a great alternative, because it gives them a great starting point and a broad pool of contributions to pull from to get to market faster. All right, that makes a lot of sense. Well, thanks, Glenn. All right, thanks, appreciate it.